parents of the Oxford shooting victims continue their fight for justice. They're asking the attorney general to investigate the school district's role in that tragedy. CBS News Detroit's Walter Murphy talked with a legal expert to see where the case could go from here. That's right, those parents are still fighting for justice for their children who were killed three years ago this month. And tonight, they're demanding action from the state level to make sure that justice that they seek is served. Today is a call to action for the state to conduct an investigation of the Oxford shooting. That is the father of Hannah St. Juliana, one of the four students shot and killed at Oxford High School on November 30th, 2021. On Monday, St. Juliana and the families of the other victims asked the state to take action and for Michigan Attorney General Dana Nessel to step up to the plate. Specifically, the Attorney General has said she can't do an investigation because one, she doesn't have the authority. The, uh, the Attorney General of the state of Michigan unequivocally has the authority to conduct an independent investigation into the matter regarding the crumbly shooting. However, Nessel says that she has to be invited by Oakland County Prosecutor Karen McDonald. McDonald, however, says she was unaware of that fact or how to go about sending the invitation. She is the head of the state law enforcement entity. I'm not sure what her motivation might be, but hey, let's, you know, the infighting between these offices is absolutely ridiculous. It's obscene. At the end of the day, Convertino says it has to stop so that tragedies like the one that happened on this snowy day three Novembers ago never happen again. Everyone in the community deserves it. Let's let's get moving. Let's let's put aside this petty nonsense and get get this going. As we previously reported, the shooter as well as his parents have already been held accountable for the role that they played in this deadly school shooting. Where this current case goes is still anyone's guess. Reporting downtown, I'm Walter Murphy, CBS News, Detroit.